John Deere diesel air compressor it's a Sullivan D185 something or other let's go look at the name plate make that out D185 QJD5 1996 vintage bought this at auction didn't run obviously it was inoperable so I got it for a pretty good price found out that after putting a battery in it and a new fuel filter because it was missing the fuel filter it would turn over but it wouldn't start so we bled the injectors all these guys bled all those out got fuel to it push this bypass button push this bypass button while we're starting it and it fired up so there was something going on with the bypass button trace the wires off of the injection pump all the way over here to this little temperature sender deal so took the took the wiring to the temperature sender tied them together and their thing runs tits so gotta buy one of those sending units it wasn't pushing out air out of this here what do they call this thing a sump so it wasn't pushing air out it would it would cycle up 150 psi before you could blink your eyes and then uh nothing would come out it was not, not pushing any air out so opened it up drained the oil cleaned it oil cleaned the oil out put new oil in it there's a little sight glass down here for you to see your levels i don't need to put some more in there didn't put enough in so anyways this valve right here it's supposed to go you know the tubing is supposed to go from here to your to your work end this valve was frozen up so took a brass drift actuated that valve back and forth you know pushed against the spring and it works 2435 hours 0.4 Somebody had changed the oil at 24.35 in uh, February of 2016. I'm guessing they probably ran into a problem where this thing wasn't uh, wasn't operating right, so they parked it, and that's where it sat before it went to auction. Uh, this is all bent right here. This whole side was caved in. We've got the door over here, been beating on it annoying the neighbors trying to get that thing cleaned up and straight enough to where it'll shut but other than that it runs good it runs great actually when I pulled the sump apart the cap off the sump this cap here when I pulled that off of there I accidentally broke the gasket so now it leaks out of this piece it'll build pressure but it leaks like a son of a bitch I need to get a new gasket for that or make a new gasket out of some of that comedic stuff. Get that fixed and I should have a pretty good working air compressor. Diesel number two to the fleet. I hope the Massey Ferguson doesn't get jealous. But plans are to run this thing. I don't know what that shit is. What is that shit? plan is to run this thing with a sandblaster in the backyard sandblast parts I need and general clean things up I don't have a reliable air source well I, I didn't have a reliable air source in the backyard for running air tools and whatnot so I'm gonna park this thing in the back and use this as my primary air source should work pretty good I'm actually kind of surprised that it runs it's amazing anyways thanks for watching